Tonight, we have an update on today's Operation Medicine Drop. That's the event where people from all across Eastern North Carolina can safely get rid of medicines. Not in your signs, Nye Remy joins us now in the studio. So, Nye, the numbers are in. How many did they collect? Well, Courtney, they took in a total of 200 unwanted medications and they collected prescription and over-the-counter medicines that were expired, unused, and unwanted. Everybody seems to have medicine that they no longer need. And that's where the Operation Medicine Drop comes in to take those unwanted medications off your hands before getting into the wrong hands. It's not dumped in the trash can where it goes to a landfill. It's not flushed down the toilet into our water supply where it doesn't belong. And it's not sitting in the home where it can fall into the wrong hands. Which is the reason why it all started. Operation Medicine Drop is a, it began with Safe Kids NC as a resource for us to protect our waterways because we do not want families to flush medications because it will go into our water systems. It also was a way to keep children safe, just again taking those medicines out of your home. Its final destination, a medical incinerator where it's disposed of in a safe manner for the environment. Now, if you missed today's Operation Medicine Drop, there's a link on our website to find your nearest drop-off box. In the studio, Nairemi 9 on your side. Nye, thanks.